With left to Home Affairs Minister Guy Mears, the death penalty would be reinforced here. This comes as St. Lucia grapples with an upsurge in crime and the murder toll rushing towards a record high. It has been 13 years since someone was hanged here. The Home Affairs Minister says although there may be opposition from human rights groups like Amnesty International, local authorities should consider a return to the gallows. I think it is timely. And I think that once the courts have determined that and, and sentenced you to death, then I believe that we should carry out that sentence. Obviously, everybody has a right to appeal. And once the appeals have been exhausted, I think we should go ahead with it. There are no inmates on death row at the Bodley Correctional Facility. Those who were had their sentences commuted to life in prison because of the lag in granting an appeal while they were on death row. Mayor says there is need for a review of the justice system to ensure that there is a time frame on how long a prisoner can remain on death row. We need to review our laws and maybe when a judge is, uh, once, once the, the, the verdict has been handed down, there should be a time stipulated. So the judge should indicate, look, um, you, you are sentenced to death and you will be put to death by so and so a date. That will give the defense lawyers the, the appropriate time to, to lodge the appeals. And once those appeals are, are, are exhausted, I think we should do what the, the, the court has demanded, that these people should be put away. Just last week, a convicted killer in St. Kitts and Nevis was hanged for killing his wife. The government of Denzel Douglas pledged to continue carrying out the death penalty as the country battles with an upsurge in homicides. St. Lucia's Home Affairs Minister says the death penalty should be enforced wherever possible. There is no comfort in a life, whether it be as a victim of a crime or that the state carrying out its duty to its citizens. There is no comfort in it. But if a life is taken and the courts have determined that a life has been taken in return, I think it is a re our responsibility to, to do that. And we must, every measure that is available to us, as a means of deterring persons from committing crimes or committing murder, I think we should explore every one of them. Vitalis Solomon was the last person to be hanged in St. Lucia. He was hanged in October 1995. Shannon Lebon, HDS News Channel 4.